The Boys Season 4, episode number one. Ladies and gentlemen, we're here to next season of The Boys, man. We just finished up Bad Batch. I know I said I was going to jump into the act light, but to be honest, I forgot season four of the boys is coming out also season two of house of the dragon and to me those take precedent over the acolyte so the boys is what i was most excited for so we're jumping into the boys first once we finish fallout house of the dragon will take that spot then once we finish this the acolyte will take this spot we'll get to all of the shows all in due time but nonetheless man season four of the boys haven't seen any trailers for it it's been a minute since i checked out season three man probably what coming up on two years now damn near close to it it's gotta be i did watch gen v gen v was fantastic love what they're doing with that um i did see you know the actor for andre did pass away in a motorcycle accident which you know it sucks rest in peace but nonetheless we are here to season four of the boys main thing i remember from season three at least the way we ended it right we found out what the v or the temp v right actually does to you and to your body if you take too many doses of it and butcher's kind of at that point man so i'm excited to see what we have in store for this season so guys i'm gonna stop wasting time we're gonna go ahead we're gonna hop into this episode before we do i do ask if you guys are new to the channel you do hit that subscribe button comment down below what you guys want to see next man drop a like on the video for your boy for reaction will be up on patreon as well as early access to the next two episodes if you guys want to check that out link in the description down below but we're gonna go ahead we're gonna hop into this episode i made a promise you don't need me anymore i could jump you can fucking fly yeah fucking mave bro that shit was crazy dude so much happened last season i i, I gotta rewatch this entire show dude it's so fucking good damn my man lost a lot of weight huh what am i supposed to do with these she says you've been working too hard you need to eat more you pull this off i promise i'll grab all these motherfuckers i guess that was a way to address him the fact that he lost a lot of weight a lot of muscle butcher you copy where the fuck is butcher mm -hmm. <laughs> always doing some shit ah oh, yeah is this from the v or from drinking too much <clears throat> oh don't you fucking start i'm fine shock you did who are you talking to i ain't said a word Ah, uh, damn it's getting bad i wonder how much time has passed from last season to now right because they said he had 12 months on the upper end evening cunts <laughs> we're here commit a bit of our treason cover our exit one oh come off it what's your fucking door can we go with butcher steps one foot in that elevator break his arm he's become the watch guy man but you know he's not gonna do that it's not gonna sit well Pissing. <laughs> the way the music, you know, toned down to. <laughs> Kiddo, would you be scared of a bunch of cockroaches? Huh? Yeah. Uh, baby <laughs> chicks or whatever. Look, the, the point is, you have nothing to be nervous about. Come on, we've talked about this. There are only humans and toys for, for our, our amusement. amusement that's right not good for him to be raised like that man he's not gonna value human life and shit homeland is in the building if you see him not engage i repeat do not engage with homeland that means you butcher you copy he said you said engage <laughs> why don't you take ryan and try and find some huh what a great idea go for it sport does nobody come back pregnant uh what <laughs> out of pocket i'm kidding i'm kidding they're too young i'm kidding come on when i took that monster down people applauded your shareholders didn't <laughs> well that's why you and me are gonna prove to them that even with a soft on crime fucking lived hard for a president it's good business as usual <laughs> Let's make some new history. Ladies and gentlemen, Victoria oh, shit. Newman. Dude, Homelander is such a good actor, man. His name's Anthony Starr, right? Dude, it's oh so fucking good. The facial expressions, the twitching, everything. Here's a minute, would you love? She's a soup now too. I wonder what her powers are. I've got a lorry out back. I can get you out of here. What are you talking about? I know you're angry with me, and you've got every right to be. But you know how dangerous Homelander is. He's my dad. Right, he, he murdered some poor sod right in front of your eyes. It, that guy was a pedophile. Right, it ain't true. He, he's lying to you. 
Let me take you to Grace, all right? And, and then you don't got to see me no more. Oh. Uh, no. Means shit. No, William. This isn't the Neverland Ranch. Don't worry. Nothing bad's gonna happen, right? He's not even on the V. Seems it already has. Yeah, he can tell. Look at that big black mask curdling around your brain. What do you got, six months? Less? It's too bad. We're not going to have that last dance together. Oh, my God, man. Yeah, Homelander can see, right? Ryan made a face, though, when he said that. I wonder if that's going to be a changing point for him. Make him think. Oh, shit. What are you doing in Oh, here? shit. Apologies, Ms. Newman. We're with your mother's detail. What's doing? We'll be done in just a minute. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. That's what her powers are? She's a fucking soup. She's a fucking soup. Dude, what the fuck? Some Medusa type shit, kind of, but worse? Yeah. Oh, fuck. That shit tore. Oh, my God. Took her arm off like it was nothing. Bro, they come up with some crazy powers all the time, man. Every time they bring in a new soup or give someone new powers, it's always something new. Look at that. Miko said, I don't give a fuck. I'm good. <laughs> I don't know if Frenchie's going to make the jump. Oh, okay. She's back to her shit. So I guess this was her full upgrade. You know what I mean? Like, we know we saw last uh, last season she could fly, so to speak, but I didn't know to what degree they were going to they were gonna have her do it. She just got to draw that power. Crazy. So that's something new that's going to play a part for sure. She's fine. She's Wolverine. <laughs> you look good. <laughs> Christ, can we go now? Hey, Fuck. Hey. You gotta teach Butcher the meaning of the word covert. He just got made by a 12 year old. You mean Zoe? You just murdered two guys? Vic, you you shot your own daughter up with V? How could you do that to her? I needed to keep her safe. You were one of my closest friends. I mean, hell, you're dating a suit. If anyone would understand, it'd be you. Oh, right? shit. I always cared about you, Huey. That part was real. Fuck yeah. You. Oh. What is that shit? The only thing that makes sense is a truce. Hmm. Or plan B. Yeah. Like, what are we doing, Butcher? He knew that wasn't going to work. I thought Huey had something cooking in that bottle, but it really wasn't shit. <laughs> what a start to the show, the season, man. Oh, I, th this is one of my favorite shows, man. I love being in this universe. Marvin, I vouched for you. The CIA is bankrolling you. Respect, ma'am. You can always put Butcher back in charge. He's right outside. What about Starlight? She goes by Annie. Can Annie burn out Newman's fucking eyes, debilitate her? If she can get close enough to her without getting her head popped off, who knows? But we might have to accept the possibility that Newman's invulnerable. Billy Butcher. Joe Kessler. Oh, shit. Fuck me. How long's it been? Uh, I'd say 11 years, but officially speaking, none of that shit show ever happened. Then how come I remember you? I don't him. Rimming out the general's wife. Well, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Negan, bro. We need someone like you, Billy. Right fucking now. Before the soup start rounding us up and dumping us off in camps. Mm. He's about to join a boys 2.0. Holy shit, man. Our boy Negan. She got into a fight at school. Mm. Principal didn't say why, just that she KO'd a boy. KO'd. Don't you dare be proud, right? Do that punch good. I get what you saw in that guy. He was good to Janine. Because he sure as shit wasn't a D. Mm? <laughs> right? <laughs> Dude needed to reassure himself. It's because deep down there's a part of you that is still <laughs> Yeah, dude's having nightmares about everything. But it wasn't until Annie January stepped out from Vought Shadow and Homelanders that we saw the true extent of her power. Vought and Homelander aren't above the law. They can't just do whatever they want. Deep 
We gotta talk about the octopus in the room. <laughs> the octopus. It is taken care of. Okay. What the fuck? No Sir, after that debacle at Godolkin, thank you again for saving my life. <laughs> the board felt we should find new candidates for the seven ASAP. And the selection committee has narrowed it down to 25 choices. Bro, Black Noir is still good? Ooh, not that slutty cum rag. Haha, <laughs> Wonder Woman. I thought he ate a dog. He ate out a dog. What? It's a big difference. <laughs> Dude, what are these options? Sister Sage? Hell no. She was with me in Teenage Kicks for like barely a year before they canned her ass. What's her power? She's the world's smartest person. She's not smart enough to know when to shut her mouth. That actually could be useful. Amazing choice, sir. Yeah, I totally agree. He's a mensch. Did I use that word right? Mensch? You just said he was crazy. What I meant was we would be crazy to, you know, not bring him in. You had to switch up real quick. Fucking yes, men. I'm surrounded by sycophants and fucking imbeciles. It's just that you make a lot of really great points, sir. Do you... <laughs> <clears throat> Blow a train. What? What? I'm not kidding. Go over there, pull out a train's cock, and blow it. You better not get out your seat. You better sit your ass down. Sex is just a spectrum, right, bro? Get off your bro. fucking face. <laughs> this is exactly what I'm talking about. Not one of you has the stomach to challenge anything I say. Yeah. No, oh my God. I have got to carry this entire fucking company on my shoulders. You're right. <laughs> Again, you just agreed with him. This creep had photos of his quote unquote niece naked in the bathtub. What? He's an Antifa pedo who fucked around and found out. And Is that real? Or was that just spread shit? You know what I mean? Because Butcher said it wasn't real. Hey, look, I, I, I totally agree with whatever you said. <laughs> no one wants Newman gone more than me. And no one knows how dangerous she is for the country. Yeah, we may never get another shot like that ever again. I'm really bad at pep talks. Eh? You think? It's not like you have someone that can kill her anyway, dude. He blew our cover with Newman. Mm -hmm. He almost got you killed again. Uh-huh. You're the only one that wants him here. We should cut him loose. We're not cutting him loose. We're not cutting him loose. He's the one who saved Huey and brought him into this shit. So Huey's loyal to him. Not only that, but he saved him from taking the V. But I'm sure he's going to end up joining our boy Negan. Well, I was thinking that uh, you and I could scratch each other's backs. Team up. Like when you shot me in the head. I need a hand to get Brian away from Homelander. <laughs> Is that all? You're between a cock and a nod place. <laughs> Homelander put you into that posh VP slot, and he's going to make sure you spend the next four years grabbing your ankles while he shoves it up your ass. I think I can handle myself. Oh, you mean that nasty little virus they cooking up at Godolkin? Mm-hmm. No, I know about it. And I know it ain't strong enough to kill Homelander. Yeah. Damn. That answered our question. The material Huey has on me from the Red River Group home. No, no, it stop him from going to the press. Mm, stops him from printing it. Just a wild conspiracy theory from a disgruntled former staffer. Those are my terms. Nah, don't do it. That's the only thing. That's the only insurance you have for Huey not to be killed, right? Like, don't do that shit, Butcher. But it's nice to see they're bringing in the shit from Gen V, right? I, I was questioning, is it strong enough to kill Homelander? If, just if, you were a Starlight, then <clears throat> maybe we drum up some real donations? I want to help, of course, but as Annie January. No one's donating to the Annie house. It sounds like we sell raisin cookies. He's gonna have to, man. Bring out that other personality. Oh. Uh? about him and Kamiko? <laughs> These pictures, man. Oh my god, he's saving them? That's foul. Yeah, he's gonna go for her because she's smart, dude. Having somebody that's smart as shit, right? Did they say the smartest person in the world? I am almost never surprised. Hmm? 
I act him in. <laughs> He's dressed in casual wear too. Have we seen him dressed like this? You know, I would have thought the smartest woman on earth would have a nicer place. Smartest person. And that person's too smart to give a fuck about Pottery Barn. Yep. Based on your public appearances, your stylist is dyeing your hair more often. Used to be every month, now it's every 2.4 weeks. Did she tell you you're glowing gray or is she hiding? So between that and your enlarged prostate. But my fucking what? <laughs> look at your hands. You've been washing them more often, so likely you've been peeing more often, which makes sense. Damn. You got a lot of power, but you do age. Plus, there's that small matter your own father almost killed you. Ooh, <laughs> smart, and she ain't got a problem not being a yes man. That's what he wants. All democracies fail because people are fucking stupid. You don't need an army of supermen like Nazi Bay wanted. So dream. If you crush the masses, who builds your monuments? Who tongues your taint? No. Uh, the people will tear it apart themselves. Just gotta nudge them a little. Then you get to swoop in, be the one saving it. Dude's like, why didn't I think of that? I'd like you to join the seven. No fucking way. Why not? Because I'm not wearing some vaguely racist super suit in front of a bunch of clapping seals. Plus, I'm a black woman who is a thousand times smarter than you. Your ego can't handle it. Mm. I'm pretty smart myself. See what I mean? Smart enough to listen. <laughs> This is what he wants, man. Someone who's not a yes man. And when you take somebody who's literally the smartest person, not woman, person on the earth. Why didn't I pick up? I mean, maybe I could have seen it coming. I could have, I could have. No, 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 Huey. Don't beat yourself up about it. There's nothing you could have done. All he ever wants is to chat about some stupid fucking James Patterson book that he's reading and I couldn't even give him that. And now they're saying that even if he lives. Might not be the same. Oh. <laughs> Huey? Hey. Hug from Butcher doesn't happen often. She wonders uh, how a man such as this win the love of a woman like Monique, you know? Oh, he's, uh, he's nice to my daughter. Come on, there's only one reason. <laughs> Todd must be picking some serious heat between his legs. <laughs> Seriously, Frenchie, you did not have to come. Okay, I'm only saying the man has some serious Pete Davidson energy over there, no? <laughs> oh, shit. Do you recognize her? Yeah. Not sure. Damn, dude, she's gonna use them to help push an agenda. I just wanna say it's a huge honor to be here with you. Right. No, I can't stay long, but I heard that you are some of my biggest fans, supporting me when others turn their backs. I just wanted to personally say thank you for your devotion and your sacrifice. Sacrifice? I want you to take these bats and beat these gentlemen to death. Oh my God. Oh man, and this is where he's supposed to swoop in and kind of save the day type shit. Oh no. Think. Noir said, I'll start. Oh my God. Yo, what the fuck? That was so fucked up, you guys. Oh my God, he talked. He should be a destroyer, no? Did he get a picture of him? Hopefully he got a picture of him. I don't think he did. Not guilty! Oh, okay. Fuck you, fascist! Yep, someone's gotta start it. <laughs> this is how some shit gets started, man. Plants like that. And they're gonna say the people on Starlight's side threw the first punch, so to speak. There was always some signs, I feel like, in the early seasons for Frenchie. People talking about it, right? But we always thought him and Kamiko. Mm, is he supposed to take their bodies, maybe? to the courthouse where the riot's happening, be like, look, they killed him. She's trying not to use her powers. Rip his fucking ear off? Is that Mike Tyson? Yeah. Yep. Martyrs. But he has pictures, he knows. 
Violent attacks by Starlight supporters left three innocent patriots dead. Now, out of respect, we are going to wait until all families have been notified before we release the names of the victims. His OCD shit. These pictures could be the saving grace for them. I don't want Butcher to die. My mom loved him. Well, what about you? I mean, I don't even think, like, even if Homelander was like, all right, let me save him for him, there's nothing you can really do, right? So fucked up. You have every right to be upset. He has the octopus here. Look at me. We wouldn't have to hide our love anymore. <laughs> oh, shit. Dio. That's what who you think seeing. I'm trying to do here. I think you're about to fuck over Huey again. And it's going to blow up in your face again. Well, I saved the kid at the tower, didn't I? I had a clean shot at Homelander, game set and fucking match, but I chose to save him. I don't do this shit, man. I mean, can't he just make like a copy? Oh my God. <laughs> what the fuck, bro? They really just showed that here at the end. Holy shit. The boys does not give a single flying fuck, man. They don't. <laughs> Literally like, holy shit. Oh, dude, what is that? What was that? The facet. Oh my god. This music. I'm trying to think. Did this ever have any after credits? I don't think it did, but I'm gonna leave it playing just in case it does. The boys! Season four, episode one is in the books ladies and gentlemen what an episode it was dude i love this universe man it just puts a smile on my face this is like one of those shows the entire time i'm watching i just smile dude because it's just so damn good from the dialogue the characters the visuals the action the superpowers you know the bloodiness it, it it's phenomenal man i cannot i don't think i can be happier with this show man you know, not only that, we just brought in our boy Negan, Jeffrey Dean Morgan. Fantastic addition to the show. I'm pretty sure we didn't see him in the previous seasons at all, man. So fantastic addition to the show. Uh, Sister Sage, or just Sage, right? Interesting addition. You know, Homelander has always just had yes men around him because everyone's so scared. So now that he has literally not only someone around him that's going to give him ideas and tell him when I, his ideas are shit, but literally the smartest person on the planet. I don't know how the fuck we're going to stop him at this point, man. I really don't. Starlight's, you know, foundation looks like shit now because they kind of threw the first punch and now it looks like they killed those three people. Granted, you know, our boy, you know, Huey, or not Huey, our boy Marvin and them, He's got the picture, so maybe that can come back. But the thing is, it's like, there's no date or time on those pictures or anything like that. All you, all you have proof of is that they met with her. You know what I mean? And that's it. And she doesn't even have a connection to Homelander at this point yet, right? Because I don't think they got pictures of Homelander at that place when he took off. I don't think he took any pictures of him, man. Which why would he, right? He wouldn't think anything of it. But I'm sure when he thinks back to it, he's gonna um he's gonna connect the dots so to speak man eventually anyway but fantastic start to the season fantastic start to this episode and fantastic ending all around dude everybody's kind of at a crazy point and i feel like with this show there's just no slowing down dude you know what i mean back in season one when we first started it it started out fast man the show did but like when you look at what we're into now and the things we're into now the characters we're with now and everything like that it just doesn't even compare i feel like like the level we're at now is just so insane all these different soups all these different powers you know we have somebody that's close to homelander's level in the case of soldier boy granted he is put back in, in sleep right now but we know he exists butcher he can take the temp v and somewhat compete with homelander a little bit it just ah, dude this and invincible are fantastic man the, the those two universes the, these two are these are some of my favorite shows i think ever so i'm excited to see how we continue the show excited to see how we continue the season i know they dropped three episodes at once for this premiere and then i think it's going to be one a week but i'm going to be checking out one a week i want it to last i want to savor it because i 
love this shit man but guys let me know what you thought about it in the comment section down below like always if you guys did enjoy this reaction video make sure to leave a like if you guys are new to the channel hit that subscribe button full reaction will be up on patreon as well as early access in the next two episodes you guys want to check that out link in the description down below i hope you all have a wonderful day and i'll see you in the next one what is going on guys i hope you all did enjoy that video you just checked out if you did make sure to drop a like and comment down below what is something you guys want to see me react to next on the channel i want to give a couple quick shout outs to some of my highest tier supporters over on patreon man shout out to the homie that's so gordo the homie alexander collins and the homie christopher larimer your guys' support is much appreciated if you guys haven't already and you do want to join the Patreon family, the link is on screen right now, as well as in the description down below. You get early access to a bunch of videos up to two, sometimes even three weeks in advance, full length reactions, and you get to participate in polls to help decide what we do and what we react to on the channel. But I hope you guys all have a wonderful day and I'll see you in the next one.